Here they are, the leaders after the first compulsory dance as we welcome you back to the Olympic Halle in Munich and the World Figure Skating Championships. Maya Usova and Alexander Zulin. Much talk about costumes. <laughs> this is kind of out of character for them. It really is. It doesn't seem to project this subtle Latin flavor that, that we're really looking for in this dance. But uh, I'm sure what they project on the ice is, is going to be a little bit different than the costume. <laughs> showing the confidence of wanting to be the world champions. This is it. I thought it was a great dance. They showed some real depth in their edges that I don't really think we've seen out here yet today. We'll see what the judges have to say. And it really complicates the whole picture of the dance competition, which so many expected would be Klamova, Ponomarenko against the Duchenis, but they really add a third intriguing element to this whole picture. has such elegance on the ice and, and it's very obvious to see her extensive ballet training her background and uh, she's just lovely to watch here are the marks a six they get a perfect six from the soviet judge five eights and five nines first place marks from each judge but the french judge who scores them 5-6, but Usova and Zulan will be the leaders after the compulsory dances. Here are the Canadian champions.